The new Panther KF-51 main combat tank is being offered to Ukraine by German arms manufacturer Rheinmetall. If deliveries continue, the Panther will be the most sophisticated NATO armor participating in the West hybrid war against Russia. How dangerous would the KF-51 be to Russian tank crews? What are its characteristics? Last week, Armin Papperder told German media that his company is already talking to Kiev about the potential delivery of the Panther KF-51, the company's most recent heavy tank, subject to German government approval. Production could begin in as little as 15 to 18 months from now. One of around a dozen next-generation main battle tanks, the Panther was just debuted in June at the Eurosatory Arms show outside of Paris. The main selling point of the tank is its enormous 130mm main gun, a significant improvement over the Rheinmetall R120, a 120mm smoothbore mounted on the Leopard 2, USM-1 and Brahms, Japan's Type 90, and South Korea's K-101. The 8% increase in caliber of the new gun, according to Rheinmetall, will double the kinetic energy generated by the weapon. This means that shells, which weigh more than 30 kilograms and extend more than 1.3 meters in length, will have a lot more punch when aimed at enemy tanks, vehicles, buildings, and other targets. The tank's upgraded main cannon can fire shells up to 6,000 to 7,000 meters which is twice as far as the Leopard 2's 3,000 to 4,000 meter range. The Panther KF-51 is a new main battle tank developed by Rheinmetall, a German defense contractor. It is designed to be a significant upgrade over the Leopard 2, which has been the backbone of the German army for decades. The Panther KF-51 has a number of features that make it a formidable tank. It is armed with a 130mm smoothbore gun, which is larger and more powerful than the 120mm gun on the Leopard 2. The Panther KF-51 also has a new armor system that is designed to protect it from modern anti-tank weapons. In addition to its firepower and armor, the Panther KF-51 is also equipped with a number of advanced technologies. These include a digital fire control system, a network communication system, and an active protection system. These technologies make the Panther KF-51 a highly networked and interconnected tank, which gives it a significant advantage on the battlefield. Some have called the Panther KF-51 a Russian tank-killing wonderwaffe while others have dismissed it as a roided-up Leopard 2. However, there is no doubt that the Panther KF-51 is a significant upgrade over the Leopard 2, and it is likely to be a formidable opponent on the battlefield.